Good afternoon, welcome to Showbiz Now here on Joy Prime, the home of entertainment, real entertainment for that matter. And yes, we're getting into the stories. Don't forget that we'll sit down. The 30 minutes is beginning today. So we have a lot and lot of conversations to have here on the show. But before we even get into, into all the you know trending issues and talk about them, let's do our foreign stories and Pink cancels that Sydney show due to illness. Well, sorry. It's like we burn so bright, we burn out I made you chase me, I wasn't that friendly My Pink is under the weather and yes, so the What About Us singer was forced to cancel her beautiful trauma concert in Sydney, Australia this Friday after falling ill and needing to take a couple of days to rest. Now, she says, hi, my Sydney friends, it is with great frustration that I bring you this news. Friday's show will be postponed. Pink tweeted on Wednesday, I was hoping a couple of days of rest would help me kick the sick but not at the speed I was hoping for. I appreciate your well wishes and understanding. I am sorry, she says. Now, this isn't the first time this year that uh, the 38-year-old entertainer has to, uh, you know, cancel the post uh, pond or, you know, probably even do the show at all after getting sick. Now, imagine Pink had to cancel her show in Montreal, also explaining that her entire family have been battling this awful virus flu for two weeks now and i have battled my way through these shows because postponing sucks and so yes uh in case you were looking out for that show it's not happening away from that let's talk about charlie shane and he claims that he can't afford child support after being back blacklisted in hollywood check this out hello key <laughs> Oh no, wrong house. <laughs> I'm lost. Charlie Sheen doesn't seem to be winning these days. Now the fallen TV star is claiming he's having a difficult time paying child support for four of his children. Now court documents obtained by People Magazine Thursday revealed the former two and a half men star filed request to modify his payments to ex-wives Denise Richards and Brooke Muella. Now the 32 year old who shares two daughters with Richards 47 and twin sons with Muella 40 and says that he can't afford to make his monthly child support payment because he's been unable to find steady work and has been blacklisted from many aspects of the entertainment industry. Now, the actor also claimed that he has had a significant reduction in his earnings and is suffering from a dire financial crisis. Now, Shin, who allegedly has less than 10 million US dollars to his name, went on to claim he's unable to pay several debts due to his finances. How sad. Box office, uh, and we're talking about top 10 comedy movies of all time, and we've been counting down. Now, let's check out number four and three. Officer Washburn is having a bad day. Officer Washburn. That's funny. Is having a bad month. Three cars you total. That is 11 points on your license. Don't take my license, please. It's gone. Attention all units. Proceed to Manhattan Savings and Loan. We have a 1030 armed robbery in progress. Suspects armed and dangerous. Freeze, police officer! I'm gonna need a car! <laughs> First guy I picked it. Why? Well, they say geniuses pick green. But you didn't pick it. <laughs> Be nice to this one, okay? Okay, I'll try. Now, he will enter their home. You know, Greg's in medicine, too, Larry. Oh, really? What field? Uh, nursing. <laughs> <laughs> not, not a lot of men in your profession, are there, Greg? So at number four was Taxi in 2004, at number three was Meet the Parents in 2000, at number two, Dumb and Dumber 1994, and number one is Home Alone 1990. Check them out. You spilled the salt. That's what's the matter. Quick, toss some salt over your right shoulder. What the hell? Hey. 
Want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? Guys! 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 Skis, huh? That's right. The yours? Uh-huh. Both of them? Did you lock up? Let yeah. Be Do we set the timers on the lights? Mm-hmm. What else could we be forgetting? Our troubles will be ours. Kevin! Ah! Home alone. Police in the northern suburbs are on the lookout for a pair of burglars who are calling themselves the Wet Bandits. We know that you're in there. It's Santa Claus and his elf. Get off my property. This is my house. I have to defend it. Where's your mother? My mom's in the car. Where's your father? He's at work. What about your brothers and sisters? I'm an only child. Where do you live? Can't tell you that. Why not? Because you're a stranger. He's a kid. I mean, what can a kid do to us? The kids are stupid. I know I was. You still are, Marv. This is it. Okay, so people, this is it here on Showbiz Now. We're doing the 30 minutes uh, and it's starting from today. Now, always ensure that you tune in because your favorite blogger will be joining us and then we'll have a look at some of the local stories that we have. Uh, we'll delve into it. We'll take your comments as well. So we open the phone lines later on for you to also join us. Now, this is primetime television entertainment show here on Joy Prime. And we mean entertainment. Now, with me in the studio this afternoon, I have uh, blogger David Mauli, the cat last man, is in the house. <laughs> you, you, you didn't yeah. bring any cat last today. Yeah, yeah, I have the cat in, my, in, my in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so his cat last is actually in his mouth. Yes, so yeah. he, from Paul's GH? Yes, from Paul's Ghana and also uh, mm. Ghana4.com. Ghana4.com. Uh, yes. So this is the man who's always been on social media and been, uh, digging into a lot of things people have been doing. And today we've decided to bring him here to yes. have a talk with us. So uh, welcome to the show. Yeah, Showbiz now. I'm yeah. sure you've been following it. You yeah. know what people have been talking about. <laughs> <laughs> but people, let's talk about some of the issues we're dealing with today. Uh, just so you're able to also send your comments and then you can call in when the time uh, is up. Uh, we're looking at a very first story, which is I can't be MP. Uh, now, uh, Xylophone CEO has actually spoken and CEO of Men's Gold Ghana and Xylophone Media, Nana Apia Mensa, has downplayed rumors that he wants to stand as a member of parliament MP in Kaswa Central Region. Now, uh, on AdomoOnline.com had actually reported earlier this week that uh, posters of the Xylophone CEO were being circulated by the youth of Kaswa who have started a movement to make the Xylophone CEO an MP for his uh, philanthropic works in the community. Now, uh, responding to the calls in a tweet, number one actually said that, and I quote, I appreciate the call, but I am not enthused about a legislative house member status now. I am committed to creating 1 million decent jobs in Ghana within five years. Let's keep our gaze on that and that only uh, he added to it. So that is basically what we're trying to look at uh, this afternoon to find out indeed if it's a right call or maybe uh, he probably is just playing around it. There's there's possibility of him becoming an MP anytime soon. David is here. David. Yeah, yeah you know what? I mean, Ghanaians, you know, we give too much pressure. I mean, um, the man is doing well. He's done a lot of humanitarian jobs mm. and all that. Um, and I think he has other projects, he has his own ventures and all that. I the NAM vision is on yes, going, he's, he's doing also, a lot. He's also in Nigeria, so opening uh, uh, the Zalphone new branch mm. and Mez goes to as well. I think um, we need to give him some time. We are giving him too much pressure. Uh, but, need, but he's been need, around for a while now. Been, how, how much time for, is, how, are we supposed long, to give him? Uh, how, how how all the things he's doing around? are clear. We see what he's doing and yes. we know these are people, when you put them there, they will deliver. Yeah, but uh, then we are not looking at maybe the money aspect or something we just need him to prove more i mean he just came into the picture a few yes two years or something mm. ago we cannot just push him to go to parliament at this time i think we should just give him some time mm. um to prove Ghanaians wrong ah. he is you know there's always doubt about the guy and his works and all that you know people are always arguing mm. about 
You know, you get what I'm trying to say. So I think we should give him some time. I, I'm, I'm not sure. But, but are you scared uh, that he will fail when he when he gets into power? And so we should give him some more time because what are we exactly looking at? Is it about the money? Is it about the fact that he has characteristics for it? Is it about I mean, his philanthropic I mean, works? I mean, let, let's be real. Let's be real at, the, at this point. I, I think people are just looking at the money aspects where you know the man he always gives. He mm -hmm. always when he has he gives. He was recently in Kaswa. Mm -hmm. I even understand he dashed one of the chiefs. The, the, the new car. car and all mm. that you know he does this but then i still think that uh, we should give him more time to, mm. to, to so Ghanaians are putting pressure on number one he's, he's to become a member pressure. of parliament Ghanaians are giving him too much pressure mm. i mean at this point we, we just but, but, but personally do you see him delivering if he's put in that position i don't know his political background that's the only problem i have and i don't know his affiliations with the political party i only saw him hang out with uh, Nanado once um, but I don't know much. He's, like I don't know much. But evidently, about, some about of the his, things that he's doing, yeah, I mean, would want to click that. Oh well, when he's put there, he might probably even deliver. Be, be, but be, I'm looking at it from be, all that you have seen yes. as a blogger. You think that this is somebody who has done a lot, and so when we put him there, he be, would be, before before uh, Donald Trump came into power, he he had some background, political background. How he helped the political parties, mm. also his communities, and all that with his. Uh, NGOs and all that. I mean, he has set the pace already. It's so it was easy for him to penetrate through to become the president of mm -hmm. America. So I think we should still give them one some time uh, for him to, I mean, get things to put things together. He's he's the guy is he's working. Mm -hmm. You know, you, the moment but these are people we need the in, in the house, and we need people to we need him to employ more people. That's what we want in the country. There's high unemployment in the country, and so we need more people. He's and he's he's doing it. He, mm. he wants to provide one million jobs. How, how many governments have been able to do this within mm. that short period? Mm. So I think we should still give him some time to do that job. And I, I, I think at the right time, Ghanaians themselves will, the entire Ghana, it, should, it, it wouldn't be only Kaswa, but it would be the whole of Ghana. We mm. will push him to go into politics. This, this is an artist that has, a, a manager or a boss that yeah. has a lot of people under him in terms of his record label and all of that. Yes. All the artists that they are under him. Yeah. You, you think that he's doing something better with them. And, and so if we give him the opportunity or if he gets in there, he will still succeed. I mean, the likes of Becca, yeah. Shatwali and all of that. You I think mean, he's, he's doing so well. I mean, for that, you cannot deny. I mean, he's, he's, he's employed a lot of people. Aside the record label, He's doing something very well with the, the men's gold and all that. Mm. So, and Zalfo Cash and all that. If not for Anas, um, it would be sponsoring the Ghana uh, the Premier, Premier League, League yeah. and all that. He's doing a lot for the country already. But I think it is too early. And I also believe, I still believe that Ghanaians like giving pressure. Like, the moment they see that, oh, this guy is this, mm. then you will give him pressure. Mm. That's what they do. Even they do it to the MPs and all that. When you become MP, they will call you, come to my funeral, come to this, come to my birthday, come to my <laughs> But baby. it's about doing the my, work. So if you are doing the work, why don't we push you my, so you go, you go and do the work proper? My marriage is not moving on well. You know, you <laughs> know, Ghanaians. <Gallien. laughs> so you know, Ghanaians, yeah, the moment they see you at that kind of position, yeah. they, they begin to give you pressure. So the pressure I, is just too I, much. I think the pressure is too much on Anna. No, no. They should they should give him some time mm. to set up everything, whatever he's working on. I, so I what, what, how many years before we move on to our next story? How, mon, how many years are you looking at? How many I years do you think we should give him? Nana, Nana PMS, and they should give him five more years. Like because the likes of Despite have done better than what Nana uh, Nana PMS is doing, mm. and so. I think we should still, he still needs some time. Anyway, the man himself has come out to say that, uh, well, he's not ready for that position now. I mean, he's interested in making sure that he creates jobs. Yeah. And so in the next five years, he's going to be doing that. Yeah. So let's see how uh, the whole thing pans out. But uh, you can also send in your comments and let us know what you think about it. Uh, we'll open the phone lines later. But uh, the next story we want to talk about is uh, I don't smoke weed. I don't smoke weed. Ahmafe Patricia says so. And Ahmafe Patricia, born to uh, the name Patricia Pukwajiman, has rubbished rumors that uh, uh, herself being in the weed smoking category of people during an interview with Andy Dusty on Hits FM's morning show on Daybreak Hits, he says uh, she says that she has nothing to do with that. I mean, the boys Kasasta opened up uh, extensively on the, the fact that she does not smoke weed and she has never even tried it. Now let, let's see the video of our Patricia. No, please, I don't. Were you smoking? No. So why why that tag? I don't know. The same Rumo said it was my mom who said that. <laughs> and that was so false. Yeah, internet may cancer. Sometimes, I really don't know. Uh, have you acted in a movie mm -hmm. that 
you you portrayed a smoker you acted as a smoker no I because for me at, at a at a point <laughs> I mean, most most celebrities have been tagged with names as such, you know, and sometimes you have to come out and defend yourself. Uh, you think that Ghanaians are saying things about her that out you. The truth is, I don't know. I don't know whether it's, <laughs> it, is true. It, is, it is true or false, but let's give her the benefit of the doubt. Uh, I mean, most of these gossip sites, especially the new blogs, always focus on on, you know, always the negative aspect of, of mm. the celebrities. And I think that's unfair uh, on the part of Ahonfe Patricia. I mean, she's done a lot. She's young and she's pushing. I mean, she's even working on one new... A new project, the yeah, Sheep Power. She yeah. And this girl is fighting against all this uh, the domestic violence mm. and um, child, uh, the rape and all these things. I, I think we should focus more on that part than to always but, hey, like... What would make somebody decide to sit somewhere and blog about the fact that she's a weed smoker if they've not seen anything that suggests so what are some of the characteristics about people who smoke weed i i, I don't smoke weed <laughs> so i cannot tell um, the characteristics of someone who smokes mm. uh, but i think they said there's no smoke with that fire and mm. like i said i don't so know they may have whether been. it is true or false it may it mm. may but we we still need evidence we still need evidence to prove that okay this girl is is really smoking mm. uh, i mean people have been criticizing her new image and she, i mean she looks somehow i mean if you compare the present i patricia to the uh, past um, you can see the difference mm. i mean sometimes when you as you're growing you, these changes can physical changes and all that mm. uh, maybe that is what prompted people to um, uh, just suggest that she's uh, smoking weed but Unless we have video evidence or uh, mm. we have any other authentic evidence, um, we cannot substantiate mm. what they, whatever they're saying. Looking at the, the, the rise of a you know, whole career mm. and the fact that it took a dip some time, you, know, yeah. uh, you, you think that there could be some of the reasons why people are saying that you know, she's, she, 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 she's fallen or the, the weed thing could be a reason. Or maybe people are associating her to that because they feel that she, she's not been able to move her career. I mean, the, her, car her career itself, it's, you know, her career is dependent on the, on the industry. If the industry goes up, um, she'll, she'll definitely rise. Mm. At the time that she came into, into the scene, the industry was doing really well. Even though she didn't come through the normal hardcore this it was through the YouTube and, and the boys casa and all that. But you know, you can attest to it that the industry right now, we are just, um, we are just going down. So mm. it has affected. So most, it's, it's most, not supposed most, to be that she's been smoking I, that has affected I am, her career. I am not defending Ahmed mm. Patricia uh, because I am not defending, and I cannot also make a case against her. So I don't have any evidence at this moment. But I think let's focus. So it means you've not been investigating enough as a blogger. I have been investigating. I mean, I've been hearing a lot. Um, mm. She said it on several occasions. Uh, and I think it is clear now. Let I I think we should move on. Okay. Instead of like, sticking to one thing like all the time, let let look at the the better side of our <laughs> Patricia and let's ignore this we smoking we smoking. I mean, she can smoke if if it doesn't has to have to do anything with her career and all that. I mean, it is her life. It is mm. try, It is her choice to. Yes, she shouldn't abuse it. Okay, she shouldn't abuse it. Now, you can also send us your comments on Joy Prime Official on Facebook. That's where you can send us your messages. Anything you think about what we're talking about, you can send it over there. We'll get time to read them. And we'll open the phone lines as well for you to also join us here on the show. This is Showbiz Now. And our next story, I uh, want to talk about uh, Kwade. Uh, go to the aid of a Kwade uh, Twitter user plead with Sakodia. And users on social media, especially those on Twitter, are calling on hip life artist Sakodia to go to the aid of struggling musician or comfort quad now the cause for sakura to go to the aid of the uh, fallen star started after sakura tweeted that while uh, growing up he always looked up to quad for inspiration now many jumped on the tweet and pleaded with the rapper to go and see quad and offer him any kind of help even if financial especially as he claims that quad was uh, his inspiration as a young boy now sakura however did not respond to any of the tweets and it remains to be uh, seen if the RNS uh, uh, crooner will heed to the calls and offer help to Kwade, who is reportedly still suffering from mental health issues. Now, uh, Musica has been there. Yes. You know, they've spoken to him and he says that he's back. He's, he's looking at coming back very soon. Now, yeah. Twitter users now want Sarkodie, who mm. believes that Kwade has been an inspiration, mm. to go and help the man. But, you, and your man hasn't responded. Uh, I mean, I mean, um, uh, how do you call it? Uh, Kwade himself mm. has said he's fine. 
The day the story came out about him being abandoned uh, yeah. at the rehabilitation center or whatever. Yeah. Um, he even tagged me on, on Twitter. Oh, okay. I guess it might not be him, but I know he works with uh, one guy, Fred Pong. Okay. He, he does a PR for him. And he said it's fine. He said it's fine. That should be the end of the story. Those Twitter people should shut up. I mean, Sakwadi is not the father of um, uh, uh, Okonfoku Ade. He's not related but to But he needs Okonfoku help. Ade. I'm coming. He Sakwadi has been an There are a lot of Sakwadi. people. Why don't they focus on other people other than Sakwadi? Is Sakwadi the only richest artist in Ghana? They should call on Shatawale and the rest to come. They should call on Ie or they should call on Ochami Kwame and the rest. So you I think uh, uh, Sakwadi's I mean, Twitter followers are making noise? No, no. They, they are just talking they, anyhow. Yeah, some of them. I mean, I, I cannot attack. I, and I don't want to attack anybody, but I think they should shut up. I mean, Sako, uh, the guy said he's, he's okay. I don't know why they are trying to pressure your guy. No, even your if he's okay, what, what stops Sako there for showing him like, small okay, thousand Ghana okay, cities, even but, if he's okay? You know, is it a crime if Sako decides yeah, that, okay, you are fine, but I still want to give you some thousand Ghana cities or two thousand Ghana cities? Don't, they shouldn't push it. But he's not doing it, and the people some think fans, that, well, we we'll follow you, so we can push you to do no, it. These no, are fans no, but, who are very happy about the fact that the man is Are you saying Sako there is not aware of the whole situation. Mm. Are you telling me Sakode is not aware? But he, he knows that he's not doing anything he, about his analysis. Sakode mm. just married. Please, can we leave the guy alone? Can we just leave him? Let him enjoy his You need to say that he's using all the money to get no, married or what? No. I mean, I believe Sakode is the only one that has free. Sakode did a free wedding. He did a free wedding. He didn't even spend 10% on it. Are you serious? I'm telling you. No, look at the sponsors and all that. Are you serious? I'm telling you. He did a free wedding. That's one of the benefits of being a celeb. Okay, so let's look at his attention. Shut up. I mean, you are not the one to tell Sakode what to do with his Folks, you can also call us and let us know what you think yeah. is 0302211698 or 699 that's the number you can call us on this afternoon let us know what you think you can also send your messages on our, our, our facebook page uh, joy prime official that's where you can send your comments and let us know 0302211698 or 699 and let us have your say here on showbiz now on joy prime real entertainment and uh, blogger david mauli mm -hmm. Yes, here with me in the studio, we're talking about lots of issues. We've spoken about Sakodia and Okonfor Kwade. Twitter followers believe that he's supposed to go out there and show some love to the man Okonfor Kwade. Sakodia is yet to actually respond to it. And then also, we've spoken about Anfe Patricia. She says she does not smoke weed. So, Ghanaians, please, uh, David Mauli thinks that you guys yeah. are putting too much pressure on yeah. him already. Uh, Nam one is also in the news, and Nam one. Uh, Kaswa people say you should go and be MP by force. <laughs> and David believes that we're just giving him too much pressure for nothing. You understand? So uh, these are things we're talking about uh, today here on the show. You can also join us and let us know what exactly we're talking about. So now let, let's look at the fact that um, if indeed the man says that he has decided to come out and then have a collaboration with some artists and all of that, you, you think Sakodia is somebody who's ready to have a collaboration I mean, with Sa this man. Sa Sakodia, now he's become more uh, more connected. Yeah, give me a, min a minute, yeah. let me do this. Harriet yeah. is on the line. Harriet. Yeah, hello. How are you doing, Harriet? I'm doing very well, yourself? I'm good, and thanks for calling in. Yeah. I, I want to talk about um, Sakodia's issues, mm. right? Um, did I leave Sakodia alone? Because he, he he has read it, and so and he's not uh, responding. As, okay, fine. As to whether he's going to um, do something about it or not, no, nobody knows. So they should just leave him alone. Hmm. Well, I is also on the line. Well, I good afternoon. Yeah. How are you doing, bro? I'm doing fine. Welcome to Showbiz Now. We're listening. You said. I said welcome to Showbiz Now. We're listening. Hey, I said it. Afternoon. Yes, we, 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 yes, we can hear you. Go ahead. Yeah, I said it. Well, well, you, <laughs> well, you, can you try and then um, stop listening to yourself when you call, please? Um, uh, let's let's get into some of the uh, issues that have been happening. Yeah, you were saying something before, um, David Mauli. Yeah, so um, Sakwade is more open now. Now, Sakwade, uh, even recently, he agreed to do a collaboration with. Um, Yao Safuma, uh, uh, Yao Sa Nana, uh, Yao Sapon, okay, the uh, gospel uh, legend. So I, I think it's it's free now. Sakode is more access accessible. I mean, it's not like those days. I mean, you, you know your <laughs> <laughs> 
So uh, those days I mean, was bad. It, eh? it, 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 this is even the easiest uh, uh, time for for Konfoku, the, the likes of Konfoku and other legends to uh, connect with Sakodi and work with me. I believe Konfoku even. Uh, okay, let me let me let me get to Terry. Terry. Yeah. Yeah. Talk to me. Yeah, this is Jerry calling from. Home. Can you speak up a bit for us, please? Yeah, yeah this is Jerry calling from home. All right, go ahead. Yeah, I want to talk about Sakodi. Okay. Yeah, I said we should leave him alone eh and they should leave him alone <laughs> <laughs> okay hilda yeah uh yeah we're listening to you please i'm talking about our uh, party's um problem okay the issue is yeah because uh it's like uh if the person is smoking or not it's not compulsory <laughs> <laughs> so well, you think we're disturbing her Yay, because the person is not responding, like, he doesn't care it's part of his life or whether it's not part. Okay, okay, thank you. Um, Adam is on the line. Adam? Yeah, hello. How are you doing, Adam? I'm doing good than you. I'm also well. Thanks for joining us. Oh, you're welcome. I only want to comment on Ahofe Patrick comment. Yeah, go ahead. Ghania should leave her alone. She's doing the best, so she should leave her alone. Okay. Okay, looks like everybody thinks that we're disturbing these people too much. Yeah, uh, yeah. Mm. All right, thank so you. <laughs> thank you very much for calling. Um, Godfred, Godfred, talk to us. Um, Hello? I want to talk about... Hello, Godfred. Hello. Yeah, go I ahead. want to talk about the... I'm uh, for three issues. All right, go ahead. Oh, we lost Godfrey over there. Sorry about it. You can also give us a call. Let us know what you think about the issues we're talking about here on Showbiz Now. And, well, I have David Mawili in the studio with me here. And, uh, <laughs> well, Dave, <laughs> in summary, what do you want to say about all the issues that we've spoken about before we, we actually take it? I think, I think Ghanaians should take their time, um, especially when they're trying to criticize people. The, and, next week. All right. Uh, uh, should I go ahead? Uh, yeah, so I think Ghanaians should take their time when when it comes to criticism. They should, should always, they say there's always two sides to uh, every story. Mm. So they should always look at the, the other side before you judge. If you don't know any judge based on only one side, mm. you, 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 you'll you be wrong. So mm. they should take their time. They should leave at home for Patricia. Mm. And, 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 but but and some of these comments they, actually speed up, to, speed up they, things. They are so. speeding up too much. No, but some of these things, they actually help. They, they help, mm. but then until you have evidence on a homophobic Patricia issue, what are you speeding up? Mm. What are you speeding up? Are you, can you say you are speeding a car when you are not driving a car? Mm. It's, it's impossible. So you should have enough evidence. And for Kaswa people, it's okay. They should give the man some time to, to make a certain mark. We, we just need him to do more uh, to prove to Ghanaians that if he goes to the parliament, he can, he can, he can do better. Mm. And for Sakwadi issue, yeah. they should leave Sakwadi. Mm. Sakura is not the only celeb in the country. They can call on us other celebrities to do that. And, uh, and it, like, Maybe when he starts, the others will also yes, follow. Yes, so. uh, he's, he's doing well. I want him to come back. I believe he's the greatest Ghanaian rapper of all time. Are you serious? I'm telling you, I'm serious. Like, he even inspired me to, to do showbiz. Whoa. Even at the time, those is, ah, I used to listen well, to his cassettes. Last. Ah, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> he's the greatest. I mean, he's, he's, he's far better. He's better than all of them, I'm telling you. And I mean it. It's mm. far, it's far. The only person I can say is a little closer. Uh, who cry? As in one of the, the, yeah, the, the best. best rappers. Mm. Uh, it, it will go to Lord Kenya. And then maybe I will look at Manifest. Ob, ob, uh, look at Obra. Oh no, Manifest, yeah. Manifest is good. I mean, Manifest is good. We all know he's good. But I know he's like a, a he's like a politician in a rap. Uh, uh, fraternity. Mm. Uh, he will come and brag and blah blah blah. Talk those big, 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 big grandma, and then he's gone. He's like that. He's, you know, we have rappers like that. Who, those who think they are brilliant and they are blah 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 blah. But then in the end, you will see people like Sako they are succeeding and all that. So I think for manifest, if you wait, if you Sako, they will put Sako there before manifest. <laughs> yeah, but I'm wondering why Sako just never has popped up yet. That's that's Sa David Mawili for you. Sako, they will come after after. Or bra for and uh, if I uh, need yes. this money, I'm sure most of the people will go back.
Yeah. All right. Many thanks uh, to you for watching. Many thanks to the production yeah. team for watching. Yeah. And thanks to you for coming yeah, on the show as well. And I hope yeah. to have you some more yes. uh, here on Showbiz. Now, God willing, tomorrow we're back at 12 o'clock. Okay? Of course, at 9 o'clock, we'll bring you uh, updates. And then at 11, we'll bring you updates. And then at 12, we'll sit down. We'll have a conversation proper. My name is KMJ. I was born to talk. Thanks for watching.